Would the world be a better place if we put a minimum age of 18 on social media, why, why not? Not taking a position either way. Just food for thought. In China, they banned children from playing online video games past 10 p.m. on weekdays. To play, you must enter an ID number. Only given to adults. The number of players aged 60 to 85 skyrocketed. Obviously not because the elderly suddenly got into League of Legends when the kids were gone. But because the kids simply borrowed grandma's ID card. The government has so far been unable to enforce this law. Aside from having to actually verify which is kind of scary in my opinion, most will just lie. I mean, PH and porn sites say, you can only view this content if you're 18 plus. Do kids just be like, oh okay I'll come back when I am 18. Most sites have an age requirement. Usually around 13 plus. But it's not that hard to lie about the year you were born. I did it constantly when I started using the internet in 2005 and I was 8 to 9. I'm supposedly like 90 years old on Facebook lol I don't think age restrictions change who's using. Platforms. Late to the party. As terrible as it is for self-esteem body image. Whatever else. I think the far bigger issue is parents posting enough pictures of their children that Facebook and whatever else has ready-made profiles and algorithms that have been following them for X years. With privacy going away nearly everywhere in every facet, the young generation doesn't even have a say in their own privacy from the get-go. But yeah IG is probably destroying young people's body image and standards. Have you seen Facebook? A maximum age would be better. I think that this would be impossible but I also think it would have a really good impact on children and their self-esteem. I didn't really have a low self-esteem until middle school when I got social media. Could also stop grooming online and such. However, a lot of kids use the internet as a form of escapism from abusive households by meeting people online. It's kinda a tough call IK many of my middle school friends were saved from suicide by meeting friends online and playing online video games BC it got their mind off it the bad stuff happening in their life. No, the world would be a better place if they changed the algorithms, not arbitrary restrictions. Nah. The world would be a better place if social media companies had significantly less power than they do. And if parents raise their children to have a healthy relationship to the internet and social media. 18 doesn't matter if you're unprepared for how to manage social media and everything that comes with it. We're really just in the beginning stages of seeing what it's like to have children grow up in a world where you can access everything online literally anywhere anytime and as a society we're completely unprepared for how to do that and have generally been very bad at predicting what the future will look like and how we can anticipate our changing needs based on technology that evolves much faster than we can i lied about my age on video games all the time as a kid I feel like that's exactly what most underage people would do on these apps. Executives of social media companies don't allow their kids to use their product. That should tell you all you need to know. No. Even if you have to verify your age. Most kids' parents who don't care will happily enter their information. No. There's a lot of idiots over 18 too. I don't think so. Some of the worst offenders on SM are 40-year-old soccer moms living out drama like 13-year-olds. It would be a better place if we abolished social media entirely. I don't think so. I think that teenagers should start being a part of the world more and more progressively. And this is just part of the way people interact now. Also. 
I've learned so much about people and just general knowledge on places like Reddit and I think it would be a shame to rob young folks of that. Just like with porn, people will just lie and click the I'm 18 box. Don't think so. Social media really opened my eyes to being more compassionate and supportive of minorities. Neurodivergent individuals and queer people and understand their perspective better when I was 15 to 16. If not for social media I would have probably been much more narrow-minded. No because the cancer will still be there. And people will lie about their age just like we all used to do for porn sites as teens. It's a tumor that needed to be removed before it could metastasize. But we are well, well past that point. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epicaracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.